Seven. We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time. I've never been claustrophobic until now. I've never been in such a state of regret. Dirt particles floating into my eyes, oxygen running thin and my heart racing. If there was one happy thing I remembered, it was how much you cared about sunflowers when it rained. You always said that they created rainbows that no one could see. It began in my garage. We stood staring at two lonely shovels and carpenter tools. Our new companions, it seemed. We made our choice and we were sure about it. Maybe we should have built a treehouse for the local ghosts instead. We walked hand in hand eight long miles. Eight miles isn't long if you think of them as your last. We appreciated everything that surrounded us. Even the empty beer cans, stranded couches, and the rubber from blown tires. Maybe we should have prepared a picnic on the beach for the local ghosts instead. We arrived at the place where we first met. A cinema used to stand here. The local ghosts used to stand here. They used to laugh, smile, hug, and pass notes. Now they only whisper and give us chills. All that remains is an abandoned parking lot and a pile of smolder rubble. There was a fire. We were outside kissing on the bench. Hopelessly we watched our friends turn black and crumble. Maybe we should have opened a new cinema for the local ghosts instead. We went to the grassy area where our bench once was. Since then it had been stolen. We took our shovels and started digging. Shovel, blade to the ground, push, pry, and then toss. We dug until there were two large dirt mounds behind us, and one large, happy, inviting hole in front. Maybe we should have gone to the funeral for the local ghosts instead. We used some of the old cinema to nail together two caskets. We cut perfect circles into each box large enough for our arms. We neatly placed the black, chalky rectangles next to each other. We laid ourselves down comfortably, closed the lids, we held hands through the cutout circles. These pills should have done the trick. No two people have ever been more in love. Soon we were dancing with the ghosts, in the treehouse, the picnic on the beach, the newly built cinema, and our own funeral. Police found the caskets a month later. It was raining harder than it had in decades, and I had remembered to plant sunflowers around the hole that we dug. There was hardly anything more bliss than a love that carries us into and beyond our own grave. At least now we can witness the rainbows created from sunflowers. Dance forever and whisper chills into the living.